Hi there, this is David, and welcome back to Let's Play The Legend Heroes Trails of Azure. Last time, I, um, pretty much went and I finished up Arios. So now, all that's left is to go ahead and rescue Kia and kick Maria Bell as well as Ian's asses. Yeah, we learned that Ian was actually the one who killed Guy. As if that was, like... That really wasn't that much of a stretch, I gotta say. I pretty much figured that out the second that he was revealed to be evil. Oh wait, are these like, what's going on here? Looks like little flashes of memories or something. Are these Kia's memories? Oh, yeah, I see E in there. I even saw, like, Chancellor Osborne in there. Huh. Oh. Oh, hey, there's Kia. Wait, what? Was that showing us our deaths? What was that? Yeah. Back in Zero. But Joshua and Estelle weren't with us, but they were with us back in Zero. What's that? You're not gonna tell us! Of course not, Lloyd. Of course not. Kind of looks like the Epcot ball. Is it just me? The road to the farthest. That must be the center of the uh, Asher tree where Kia and everybody else is. No. <laughs> There's nothing to say anymore. Finally! Yeah. So I've changed my setup just a bit. Um, took off those gladiator stuff, and um, I want everyone to have something that prevents all ailments. It is imperative. Um, at least be able to prevent the burn status. That's the number one status that you want to be able to prevent. So, I didn't give anything to Tio that prevents all ailments, just the burn status for her. Everybody else has a preventing all ailment um, accessory of some sort. Also, for the orbments, I took off things like haze eagle eye, intimidation, things like that about monsters and stuff. Like, I don't really care about that. And then I put some other stuff in, like hit three. Um, let's see, what else did I put in? Uh, there's another hit three. What else? Uh, ba -ba -da -ba -da. Did I? Oh, I gave her the water gem for extra HP. I gave him the HP three gem. So, you know, I just took off a little bit of stuff to give some better stuff, I guess. I mean, there's still some of these intimidation stuffs because eh, I didn't have other stuff to put on there. But yeah, for the most part, I just took off stuff that wouldn't really matter anymore, I guess, and um, replaced it with just a little bit of stuff that would help survivability. Especially, that, that's really important, especially if you're on harder difficulty levels um, than I am, like Nightmare, you know, then it's really imperative to be completely set up for this. Well, there they are. All three of them. Maria Bell and Ian side by side in their evil. And then Kia just residing peacefully above them. She almost looks trapped above them. Of course we've come. Welcome. <laughs> Kia! 
ごめんねキーアロイドたちにずっと話せなかったことがあって。黙っていて騙していてごめんなさい What do you mean? Just tell us now. Well, I guess she's talking about how she was the Septarian of Zero and all that. Oh, by the way, if you want an easier time, take Dudley and Noel out of your party. Put in Wazzy and Rixia. They're so much better. Thought I'd figure I'd keep them in here. Not because they have any unique dialogue or anything, but because I was too lazy to go back to the Merkaba. That's pretty much it. <laughs> And it's not that big of a deal, especially on my difficulty. I don't really care. Yeah, just come back home with us. Everything will be fine. Oh, no problem, Kia. You can't move, so you are trapped. Yeah. Tell them what? What do you mean you're doing it for us? What are you talking about? Oh, so she doesn't possess the Mirage power, she possesses the time and the space powers. Um, okay, some more mumbo jumbo. Wait, you have the power to spin the world? What are you talking about? What do you mean the power to spin the world? Okay. To rearrange the world? How so? Oh, so she can like change events in time she can alter the past present and the future so she's like time traveler essentially oh well then kia could you just kind of rearrange everything that's happening right now that would be lovely let's just have a peaceful world like seriously Oh, I guess that's what she's trying to do now, or at least what Dieter was trying to do? How is that possible, though? Wait, what do you mean? Kia saved us by spinning the world? Oh, you mean that vision on the elevator? me again. What is going on here? <gasps> Wait, what? So, in the original timeline, Joachim killed us. But then Kia somehow rearranged time and rescued us? Is that what you're trying to say? Oh. No wonder... Oh! So that's why in the vision Estelle and Joshua weren't there. Because that vision is what actually happened. Then Kia, I don't know, changed time and interfered with it so that we would bond more with Joshua and Estelle. And then, you know, whenever Joachim went berserk, Renee was able to come down on Pater Mater and rescue us. Yeah. Oh, wow. And that was all Kia's doing, so without Kia, we would be dead right now. How crazy. Well, 
What do you mean? There's more? Oh. Oh, wow. So if that's the case, why doesn't she just go ahead and do it and just alter reality so that, you know, everything's hunky-dory, everything's peaceful, we just have world peace forever, you know? That would be really good, actually. Yeah, I kind of agree with Maria Bell, so why don't we just do this already? The Ars Magna. Huh. I guess that's what she's trying to ascertain here. Okay. So, why don't you do it? Why don't you use that power? Oh, because I guess it imprisoned Kia here and she can't move, and as long as she uses her power, she's stuck here or something. Oh. Oh. Yeah. The poor thing. Sounds good to me. Yeah, actually it is. I had to look up mobocracy. I can't even pronounce it. Mobocracy? That's like mob rule, you know, rule by lawlessness or anarchy, essentially. Anarchy would have been a much better word to use there. I don't think that mobocracy is really a word, but whatever. Oh. I guess so. Although, at this point, I doubt that he would really work along with you. Wait, you want us to collaborate with you? I mean, I get what you guys are going with, but you can't hurt Kia. I mean, even though Kia isn't really a person, you know, but still. She just, she means a lot to us. Oh. That's true. That's true, too. It's almost taking away people's free will, you know? And forcing people to go and take one road rather than giving people the option to choose, the, the, the option to make a mistake, you know? People have that option with free will, that they have the ability to choose the wrong path. And there's nothing that people can do about that. But I guess going Kia's route, you know, everybody would lose their free will and wouldn't be able to choose, you know, and wouldn't be able to, to really just, just to make a choice, you know? So I get where Lloyd's going with this. Yeah, come on. Just come on out of that tree. Come home. We'll kick these two's asses. It'll be fine. Oh, don't say that, Lloyd. Oh, She really has been lately, I've gotta say. Oh, that's why she was so upset. She kept on dwelling on what she did, and she realized that... I mean, she had to do what she had to do, but I guess she wished that she told us? Yeah. 
Yeah. Well, that's true. Yeah. And we'll see more of that in Cold Steel. Well, especially Cold Steel 2 and 3 and 4. I don't know really anything about 3 and 4, but I do know that we end up going into Crossfell. Somewhere in Cold Steel 3 and 4. I'm not sure which one it is, but I know that it happens. Can we just kill you now? Oh. <laughs> Kinda sorta. No, you don't. Oh. Are you realizing the error of your ways? Are you going to, you know, turn a new leaf? Are you gonna turn yourself in? Can we arrest you now? For, you know, the murder of Guy and everything? So we don't have to fight you. Huh. That was enormously easy. So it really was Maria Bell as the mastermind this entire time. Crazy bitch! What the hell? I mean, I am kind of glad that Ian's dying. I mean, you know, don't get me wrong, but holy crap! It shouldn't have been Maria Bell who killed her. It should have been Lloyd. Or at least, you know, Lloyd putting him away for the rest of his life in prison, you know, getting some sort of justice. It shouldn't have fallen to Maria Bell to dispose of him. Oh no. Seriously, what the hell are you doing, crazy lunatic? Wait, you're gonna turn her into a doll? Oh, hell no, bitch. Uh, retract that my ass. Let's shoot her. I'm done with this bitch. <laughs> マリアベルクロイス。女神を超える司法を求め、全てを犠牲にしてきた一族の末裔。その千年の猛獣の重みと、あなた方の一年にも満たぬ絆のどちらが果たして強いのか。互いに視力を尽くして比べてみるとしまし
Shockingly enough, she didn't summon more, but that's fine. Whatever. Still, just go after her. This is really the way to do it. Just wail on this crazy bitch. Woohoo, got a critical hit. Nice. Yeah, keep going. I'm not too worried about her, um, her EP. And you do want to keep... Your guard up for her S craft, which she can cast on you. Thanks, Maria Bell. Thanks. <laughs> um, let's just kill her with S crafts. Whatever. You're gonna get fully healed after this battle, anyway. So I don't really care. Easy enough. Well, we took you down. Now, can we rescue Kia? Oh, good, she didn't get turned into a homunculus. Or a doll. I guess she already is a homunculus, but she wasn't turned into a doll. Yep. Yeah, I guess. What are you saying? That you're secretly in love with Ellie? What thing? What are you talking about? Told us what? Oh no, I'm afraid to ask. What are you gonna do now? Yeah? But she's pretty much her kid. Yeah, so what are you trying to tell us? Okay. What's wrong with that? Oh. We all love her because of her powers? What do you mean, because of her powers? We don't genuinely love her? She casts some sort of spell on us or something? Oh. That is true, because normally when I meet a kid in a JRPG, I want to strangle them. But... It was different with Kia. I actually really liked Kia. Probably the first kid in a JRPG that I actually liked. That's true. Yeah? No, not really. So she did cast a spell at us in some way. It's almost like she brainwashed us. Is that what you're trying to say? Kia. The hell is this? Is Kia alright? <gasps> is this Kia's true form? Did you turn Kia into this? Or did you turn Kia against us? 
by saying that we didn't truly love Kia. Kia! この全てはキーよ。あの子を取り戻してからだ。お、well, here we are. Final boss of Let's Play the Legend of Heroes Trails of Azure. And we're going to take him on for the finale next time. This has been David. If you like this, please like, comment, and subscribe, and have a good day.